so hello guys welcome back to a new video and in this video i'm gonna show you how to install and run geezer mc on your terrorcell server i have been asked by a subscriber to make a video on this so i'm making a video i think so this will be the shortest video okay so first thing first uh, we'll download both of the geezer and the floodgate i'm doing this for an offline server okay so uh, online server it's uh, different and for offline servers it's uh, different okay some of the configurations so keep in mind that so i'm doing for the offline server so i have already downloaded it okay both the jar files okay so we come back to the panel stop the server keep in mind that if you do any edits you need to stop the server so go in files go in plugin and upload okay so i'm gonna directly drag and drop over here because it's not showing my files directly so i'm gonna just drag them both here okay and minimize wait for them to get upload as you can see it's uploaded and now we can just uh, start the server because we'll have to stop the server after it starts because of the configurations okay and now you need to come to allocations or network okay you can do create allocation or you can just you know directly do it from the admin panel this is happening because i have turned on the auto allocation system okay if you don't have it you don't need to worry you need just click on this or ask your panel admin to do this for you to give you extra ports so when you come here okay go and builds okay go here and then ask for extra ports so i'm gonna do this and this okay you can allow as many as ports if you want for one server so just update build okay and if you come here we'll get more of the ip addresses if you see over here refresh, refresh and here see and i think so the server has started already loading floodgate okay let, let's give it some time and everything has loaded successfully okay now it's really up to you which port and all you want to give okay for your flat gate i'm gonna give is 25566 okay because 25565 is good and after the 66 it goes hand in hand and it's not confusing also so first thing first we'll do geezer spigot okay i'm using a paper server okay so yeah so i'm gonna edit this port over here to 25566 okay and scroll down this is all the things we not need this is the mottd if you want you can change it's really up to you okay so this is auto here but we are using floodgate so we are gonna use floodgate over here okay so here we have to change it to floodgate over here as it says okay or auto whatever you feel it's really up to you i'm gonna do it as floodgate okay and this is as false because we are not running an online server so we can just put it as false okay and this is what it everything else okay we are not going to use all those commands for now all the things we just need only to run the plugin so that's done okay and i'm going to come back to floodgate config okay and here you can do some tweaks if you want okay everything is sorted in this file if you want to change the prefix when the bedrock player joins the server the prefix will be dot and the name afterwards and all the spaces will be replaced by underscore so i'm just gonna run my minecraft launcher okay minecraft launcher takes some time to launch sometimes depending on your internet connection and all those kind of stuff so yep it takes a lot of time so i'm gonna restart the server in the meantime and one to, one more thing you need to have the tcp and udp connection on for the bedrock so i'm gonna do it now you have the blue allow um 25566 i'll allow for the both the servers okay there's no issue so this will allow udp and uh, tcp connections also 25565 okay just for safety and now it's loading so i think so our thing is open so i'm using minecraft for windows which is the bedrock version okay 
play servers and I'll edit this. This was a testing server I was using. Coconut. Okay. So I'm gonna copy the IP the really quick copy and then paste it here. Okay. Remove this. And this is the same port. Okay. See a Minecraft server. It loaded immediately. Okay, as you can see, the ping is high because I'm using a Germany server and I stay in India. So yep. So not air server, sorry. So now we need to join server. So as you can see, we have joined the server. Okay. This is going to take a time for me because my routing is not that great for uh, Germany servers. Okay. Because it's very, very far from me and I had 160 ping. So it will take a lot of time for me, the load loading of the, for me, the loading of the world. Okay. So it will take its own time, however it wants. So this, this was it for this video. Okay. And I will see in the next video, if you have any suggestions like this, and you want me to do some of the things like this on this channel, please let me know. And I will do it accordingly if I can do it. Thank you very much for watching this video and see you. Till then, tata, bye bye and stay safe.